Hello, it's me, Karen. I've come to show you another project I have done for Kitty's Scrap Post. Um, this is the second DT project I have done. This is the paper line that I have used, and it is the Très Chic. And it is um, the Shabby Chic, all pink, lilac, and a teeny bit of peach in it. And it contains 24 or 20 full sheets that you can print eight and a half uh, by 11. Five sheets have got the uh, two prints on each side of them like this. And I did the um, last video on my journal slash file of facts <laughs> uh, project. And that's what you use these for. They also come in singles so you can print them out. And then these are the uh, five sheets that you can use for cutouts, the tags, uh, envelopes, and the little pieces that you can cut out. And that's the name and the blog spot that you can go to get it. And once you've ordered it, you will receive it within 24 hours. Okay, what I will do is show you the project. It's a little big, so you'll get to see bits of it <laughs> at a time. It is a tray that I got at Hobby Lobby. And it's one of the uh, trays that you serve, I don't know, what you serve in it. <laughs> it's kind of small to be serving breakfast. But uh, what I'm going to use it is uh, when I put um, laces and trims and stuff that I get from my DT kit from Louisa. Hi, Louisa. <laughs> so um, what I did was took taking her paper here, and I printed out the one image on here and then I uh, I printed it like four times because I cut out the pieces and I layered it on top of the original one about six or seven times with the flowers and stuff. I'll show you that in a minute. And I painted uh, the tray all black. Um, this is one of the sheets here. Uh, these embellishments are buttons and this tag here actually comes out of one of her other kits, her last kit she did. And this is a Tim Holtz clock that I uh, patinaed and got rusted. Buttons from my stash, this button and this one are from Hobby Lobby. They came in a pack. And uh, this is a little wood um, piece. It's a stamp. I'm not sure where I got that one. And this is just a lace trim that I put in here. It's a wide trim that I folded in half and then ran flat back pearls uh, down on the, the side up here. The uh, pearls I got from Saw Crafters. And now down here, I'll get you a close up. Hopefully it stays in focus and I don't shake it too much. This, I cut the postcard out, crumpled it up, and then distressed it with um, my distress ink. It's gathered twigs. And I also did that with this one, so you can kind of see it in the background there. And then I glued them on top of the original piece, paper. Along with this, I cut this out, and it's up on um, the pop tape. I think that's the dimensional tape. And I ran lace underneath it back here and up at the top. And I put some buttons down here. The flowers uh, I have cut out about I think it's three layers so they're on the tape too and then there's another layer here with just the uh, leaves and then just the rose little buds here and then the roses here here and here are all cut up separate so they're all raised I wanted to keep it at flat so that's why I didn't put dimensional flowers in here because I will be um, storing stuff on top of it and I didn't want it you know to crush it or anything. The buttons are high enough. <laughs> so, um, let's see. Did that. That All these are uh, distressed with the uh, same ink. Ran them around the edges and then on the sides we did the, um, well, did trims, buttons on the sides. So we, this, I believe I got that from Lavish Laces. It's a cute little trim. And that goes around, comes around again, and then you have them buttons here, and there. And then on the back, I just put another one of her um, pieces of paper. It doesn't quite uh, fit from end to end, 
So I, when I painted it um, black up here, I left a space, and also down here there's a space. And when I printed it, it has a little white um, down here. You can barely see the line. I just inked it so it didn't show and it gave it a little extra room. So that's the back. Pretty paper. Pretty paper. <laughs> so that is my uh, second project. Uh, it's kind of simple, but it's going to have a use, so <laughs> I like it. And the paper is just gorgeous. I'll leave links down below again. Um, let's see if I can't get it in, almost all the way in. <laughs> and uh, I'll leave a link to her shop where you can purchase the paper and um, see the other projects the other design team members have made. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. Bye.